Hi everybody, it's Chris with Smart Home HQ and today I want to talk to you about the Zapato Zippa Box. Now this cool little device, it's, uh, it's pretty small for what it does, but it is the central controller it powered by Z-Wave and it will control your home automation system. Now the cool thing about this guy, other than its size, so here's the box and here is a picture of everything that you kind of get in there and what it looks like. Now it's a little deceiving when you look at it online, it looks a lot bigger than what it is. And I'll have a little comparison here to show you uh, the difference. So this guy comes with a uh, antenna, obviously you kind of need that, it's pretty important. You have the power cord, the ethernet ports, and uh, expansion space. So there's two slots and you can add expansion modules. One of those modules is Zigbee, so if you're worried about having a Z-Wave only controller, fret not, you can have Z-Wave and Zigbee. You can also add uh, tie-ins to your existing security system. And one of the cool things is if you don't, if you have the wiring but you don't actually use your existing security system, it has a security module that you can snap in that'll let you use the existing uh, door and window sensors that are running through your house cabled. You just set the zip-up box next to that outlet or the where the security panel comes in at, tie in the cabling and you're good to go. You can actually use the pre-wired existing uh, sensors in your new home automation system. If you, don't, if you think that's uh, you know, the end of the coolness, you're wrong because it has a battery module, so you can have backup battery if it goes out, 3G, uh, and it actually can tie into power monitoring clamps and tell you what your home usage is on your energy. So let's look in the box. First you have the Zip a box. It has your power, your ethernet, a little reset, and your antenna port. Now it has a expansion slot one and an expansion slot two. Now these slots let you add on those expansion modules. It shares power out to a certain extent, but you can just expand as you need and go on from there. Now, you know, here is the antenna. It reminds me of an old wireless router. It just screws on. Now the cool thing about this is that it gives you it gives you some extension power. The antenna is out of the enclosure, so it gets it away from the unit, away from any interference, and gives you the opportunity to have a much stronger signal uh, if you were having an issue with the expansion and the coverage of your existing Z-Wave network. So look at the power. It's uh, just a regular power module. Now if you're used to like a uh, Intel Nook or a microcomputer or some of the new hubs that have um, snap-offs, so you have your power wart and then you have a US plug, a, a EU plug or anything like that. This is just whatever country you order from. So if you order from Smart Home HQ, you're going to get a US plug. Um, so there it is. You know, obviously you have an uh, Ethernet cable and then some literature and manual. So size comparison, I kind of wanted to show you. I have a motion sensor. Now this one's from SmartThings. It's one of the uh, original ones, so it's a little bit bigger than the current generation, but if you have these around the house, you're kind of used to the size. So if you look at it, not, not much bigger, just a, a little bit bigger. So size comparison wise, um, it's a lot smaller than I thought it would be looking at the pictures from the manufacturer's website or even some of the other vendors. Um, the, you do have two mounting ports in the back, so you can wall mount that. Um, you can sit it wherever you want, really. It, it's, got, it's pretty level. It sits up off the ground, so you're pretty good. Now here's the, the Zipato zip-up box. So remember, Z-Wave only, but you can add the expansion modules and grow it your network as you see fit. So that was the... Uh, the comparison of the Zippa box and then I'm going to do a couple more videos later down the road and I want to show you some cool new gadgets we have. Uh, the Fabaro push button, I love this thing. It gets six, one, two, three, four, five and press and hold. So you can do up to six scenes, six actions, turn on all the lights, turn off all the lights, press and hold for a panic. I'm working on a scene where you can use this as a garage door opener um, through Z-Wave you pull in. I haven't tested that all out yet, so I don't want to tell you that works flawlessly uh, because the device and the button would be you know, coming and going as you, if you left it in your car. Now this is another uh, Zapato product. It is an RFID sensor. So you can arm and disarm your system. It is okay to put outside and it comes with key fobs. So you can actually program with a swipe, say I'm home, 
for you know an unlimited amount of uh, opportunities there. So maybe I swipe it and I unlock the door, but it also turns on the lights, starts playing music, or runs through a number of um, other scenes that you can have available. So I'm going to do reviews on all this stuff. I'm doing some video. I'll do some Facebook Live. I'll upload to YouTube. Uh, check out the sites. Check out the uh, product, and let me know any feedback or any specific questions that you have. Again, I'm Chris with Smart Home HQ. Please check out our site at smarthomehq.net. Thank you.